Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to another video. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make a Roblox Executor Monaco. A simple Monaco, not like the old Monaco that was uh, very hard and it was like 125 megabytes. It was a lot, bro. But now, it's gonna be 1 megabyte. This Monaco is, does not have that much... Uh, what's going on? That much stuff like the other Monaco, but uh, yes. So we can just go ahead. I'll show you guys the how to do it. So first of everything, you have to join my Discord server, as you know, like always. And you gotta click on verify, and uh, yeah, we'll go to the. I'm gonna go to the uh, make executor. Right now, the Monaco is not in here. It's not in here, but I'll pause the video and I will just go look for it right now. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I just want to say thank you guys for 500 members. I really love you all. But I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to go get the Monaco. And, yeah. Alright, guys. So, now uh, we got the Monaco and we got... Uh, everything so let's look at this huge difference so we got the one megabyte and the the old one which was more like advanced and better but this one's okay I like it this is the one that I'm using so this one was 60 megabytes and this was one year megabyte so like if you put it together then it was about um, 165 megabytes People were pulling up with their executors being 300 megabytes. That's just like, that's just crazy. So, you just want to go ahead and download the Simple Monaco. Um, as soon as when you download the Simple Monaco, you just want to, you just want to wait real quick. And, um, right. so when you got the Simple Monaco, uh, you got Simple Monaco, you want to download the this one the txt file so you can like open it up and read it much more better so after we done all that uh, if you don't know how to set up when uh, microsoft windows visual studio uh to a pad i'm not even joking too bad it's, i don't fucking know uh, i'm not saying it's gonna take like uh, about five minutes and i don't have time for that but if you don't know how to set it up and uh just choose when you're on the installer you just want to choose dot net nothing else we have Wim forms app only dot net with the brackets do not choose the old ones the project name we're just gonna call it monaco simple whatever your project is like uh, anything all right uh, i just want to wait it will create the project so i'm not gonna do any ui design at all so I'm just gonna do like this, and the back color I'm gonna have it at black. Okay, so if you don't know how to make executor, I've made like advanced tutorials on how to make executors really fast and quick and with amazing UI to them. You wanna go ahead and download the CX API if you don't have it, or of course you should have this when you come into the Monaco video. You just want an API and have everything ready. So as you see, you have this ready. Uh, you wanna size is color i'm not gonna do any ui design i'm not gonna help you guys with anything you should watch my old videos or my other videos to how to make ex uh, a executor so we're gonna use web browser for this one uh what the fuck uh we're gonna get a web browser again i don't know why it's doing that i don't like this yeah no 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 why is it doing this like this? Oh, the dock. The dock, the dock. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to put this on none. Alright. So, I'm going to size it like... Like so. And I'm just going to put the uh, CX API inside of here. Um, I'm just going to choose one of these. Uh, where is it? This API, this is that simple as that and we're gonna put a button a uh, put the 
this as the execute and that one as the inject so you guys don't need to do this I just already I don't have anything to do but so I'm gonna double click on your form and go to notepad I want to get the your form to load I want to copy this one editor All right, you'll see an error I'll show you why um, see the web browser you want to choose the name as editor so this should fix the error yes just like that alright so we're going to open the notepad again and we're going to do the I don't know no no I'm not going to do that so and we're just going to use the sh uh, execute button alright so execute let's see it's an execute button yeah, that's the core functions dot AJ. All right, so just like that, uh, we're just gonna start it up, and it's not gonna work since I forgot something. I just wanna go ahead and close it. All right, so you wanna get your uh, sorry, close. So you wanna go to your uh, simple Monaco, right click it, and extract all. Just like that, we're gonna drag it to your repost folder. Alright, so now you're gonna find your um, project. You wanna go to your project. What the fuck did I just do? Right, let's put it back in here. Alright. Put the Monaco inside of your project. And put it inside of here. There, there, boom, that's it. So I haven't done the debug thing yet, let's go do it real quick. Where is it? But, obviously, uh, build any CPU to see X64. Alright, just like that. Um, right, like so, and we're gonna start it up. And you see, this is the Monaco, it looks nice, I like it. You can do print, uh, print, just like that. And we're gonna do the print actually lowercase. Alright, so it will work, it's good. I hope you guys like it. And uh, I don't have the time like, to design it, but that's how it looks like. Thank you guys so much for watching, and peace.